In 2004, the New Zealand Affordable Art Trust was established by a group of passionate Wellingtonians who are yeah, passionate about the idea of promoting New Zealand art. By August, the first New Zealand Affordable Art Show was held. Over the last six years, we've um, sold over $4.2 million of artwork to New Zealanders, proving that we are a really significant arts event and putting a lot of money back into the artist community. The main objective of the New Zealand Affordable Art Trust is for every New Zealander to own a piece of origin, original New Zealand art. The New Zealand Affordable Art Show is wonderful for the public to come and see a wide range of artwork from sculpture, ceramics, photography, pottery, um, oils, acrylics, watercolour, you name it, it's there. The average price is around $500 so there is something for everyone's budget. The, the show is a cash and carry, so if you like a piece of artwork, it gets taken off the wall and you can take it home with you straight away and another piece is put in its place. So you can enjoy that piece of artwork the moment you buy it. The show just gets bigger and bigger every year and the 2009 show was our most successful show ever. We had a lot of new, um, new initiatives this year, the Signature Piece Art Award, which is $5,000 going to a deserved artist and it's actually by a public vote. We had on the Sunday Art and All That Jazz and that created quite a buzz on the Sunday with live jazz and glass of wine. An initiative that we have expanded upon is the Single Artist Walls, which we've allowed around 80 artists to actually come and be present at the show to sell their work, to meet a potential buyer and really allowing the public to meet the artists, which is actually quite unique. The opening night was amazing this year. We had John Key opening it. And it was, we were actually really nervous before the doors opened this year, knowing that there were going to be TV cameras there and um, all the artists were excited. Um, over 1,200 people attended the evening, mainly sponsors and supporters of the Trust, but also the p people really wanting to be there to, to have a first glimpse of the art that was on offer. Once the doors open, my job's done, there's nothing more I can do, so it's actually nice for me to actually sit back, have a look, have a glass of wine and appreciate what's going on. And it's exactly the same for the artists, especially the single artist walls. They've created an entire body of work, especially for this exhibition. I mean, some of the artists actually sold over 40 pieces of artwork, which, which is huge. It was decided that for 2010, the Trust would change the show's name to the New Zealand Art Show. So hopefully we'll be embracing a, a wider public, also um, grabbing the attention of, of more gallery owners. This is a perfect opportunity for them to come and see what's going on in New Zealand art. It's good for the artists, it's good for us, and it's good for the public to know that they're actually going to be seeing quality works of art at really affordable prices.